you didn't finish what you were saying. Um, no, Sundays are going to be the best option for me to do anything on. Um, I mean, I count. I mean, I don't know what the score estimator thing is on here. But um, I need to be counting anyway to help me um, with stuff. Okay, and this this is another thing. I mean, I don't I don't do well with double. So okay. Anytime I play something like this against something like this, I usually lose. Because I don't do well with Fusaki. Okay. So, I, I just don't know how to, I should evaluate this. So, I mean, I could pincer, bring some potential to that Q4, because if I just back off, it kind of just looks funny. If I go f long, into, I, I just don't know, how, I mean, most people would, I mean, there's other people that would say, oh, this is simple, I know how to respond to this, but I'm just one of those people. I, this just isn't the path that I took to get to where I am right now. I, I just don't know how I should properly do this. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, you would back off. My first thought was simply pincering, but I just, it's just hard figuring out what would best be beneficial. Um, I mean, I personally might not back off mainly because it would be a low stone and that's a low stone I won't necessarily be able to develop all that much but if I do the pincer and we do some kind of Joseki variation it might give black potential see there's just all of these things I, I just it's hard evaluating everything so We're, we're gonna just see how things go. Just pincer. Okay, okay, okay. Um, yeah. Okay, so but we see a jump instead of some kind of pincer going straight into the corner, so. Let's see, I I want to go high because of that stone up there. And I kind of want to put some kind of pressure on those stones. I'm going to go high. I mean, if I'm wrong, I'm wrong. But something that I also remember... Um, ooh, that's bad, Black. That's bad. Um, and I... That I actually do know why. It's because it gets rid of the potential to go into the corner. But the question is, can I continue and do it correctly? Okay, so I'm still kind of glad that I went high because of this influence that Black has here. See, but there's things like this. Like... Okay, so... A lot... So... How to put it? A lot of people... I mean, like I mentioned before. A lot of people have told me that D2 is wrong because it ruins the potential of going to the corner. However, then there's this, where it's just simply connecting and it's all strong with nice influence for the center. And I got... Minimal points. I, I got maybe nine points on the left, six, and then maybe six on the bottom. But I do get Sente because Black decided to play that. So I need to find something that's equally as strong. Or big. Or better. Yeah, I'm good yeah, I'm definitely going elsewhere. I'm just trying to figure out where now. 
because I, I could approach, because I've got this here, I could later approach high here because of the previous game mentioned that um, Mr. said uh, regarding influence and whatnot. So I think I'll go ahead and do the approach. Okay, so. Yeah. It's just so straining trying to think of the Fuseki and openings and it's just what to do. So, I mean, black is going full out influence. That's what I'm seeing and getting in this game. So how to counter the influence? I mean, I could just jump out. I mean, that's my first thought, jumping out because then black will, or should, in my opinion, should jump out to O16 or O17 so that the corner isn't surrounded. And then I can put pressure on the stone by extending out to maybe R6 and building up that corner potential at some point. Because if I try doing a double pincer, it just, or just going straight into the corner, I don't like it. So maybe just the jump. I'm, I'm just trying to see if there's anything else I would do. Because I, I believe there's some kind of thing. Actually, isn't there some kind of thing with a Kaima instead of a jump? Uh, I'm, I'm just going to do the jump. I kind of let out what I was thinking, and I'm, I'm going to go with it. I'm going to leave the corner open. I will put pressure on the one stone. Can't you take all the territory and try to reduce the rest of the game? Take all the... Oh, this is someone else. Same color as um, Mr. Hey, Biz... Bezim Gassel, Gassy, Gassif, Gast. Bezim Gast? Sounds like a Pokemon name, because I know it's not a Pokemon name. Um, <laughs> let's see. Take all the territory. So, I mean, I've tried doing that before, um, bees, but I always have some kind of problem when it comes to reducing. Um, I'm always worried about going against influence because whenever I'm going against influence, <laughs> whenever I go against influence, I usually lose something when I try to reduce or invade or something. I just don't do well when it comes to uh, invasions. I mean, influence. Okay. So. I will block this way. Question is, can I play this way? Or do I just play this way? No, I'm just going to play this way. I'm going to play this way. That way I am, am a little stronger so that I can cap the... I can't cap it. I can't unless I do a diagonal. I mean, Kaima. I'm just going to back off. Yeah, you thought it was the wrong direction, and I'm kind of like, you know what? Yeah, I, I, I do have to agree with that now that I'm thinking, yeah. Because blocking the other way, it's pushing to, I, I guess I was just worried and lacking the confidence that I would be okay with those lower stones. I think I'll go ahead and do this.
Yeah, I'm gonna do this. I mean, I do know about this thing here, but I feel like I'm okay because I have M3 there. Doesn't really look like it cut. I don't see anything wrong with this result. Black still has to come back to live in the corner. Yeah. I, I don't I don't see anything wrong with this. Everything seems fine. Even if Black tries doing something out here. Yeah, yeah. I mean, it was already mentioned before that, yeah, definitely blocking at Q3 was the wrong thing. I should have been blocking the other way because this stone is low, that stone is high. So it would have been beneficial for me to have the influence going to the right side and not the bottom. So... Um, okay. This still seems fine. Still seems fine. Still seems fine. I'm gonna live in the bottom. But then again, I mean, yeah, I'm not really... <sighs> Black still needs to protect the corner. But yeah, overall, I definitely, yeah, definitely should have blocked the other way. Yeah, I don't know either. No. If anything, Black should make sure to protect the corner. But by doing that, what I need to figure out then is what to do next. I mean, I've got two stones to worry about. My right side isn't exactly alive. <sighs> but that inf is just... Maybe I shouldn't have played... See, it's just really hard to evaluate this. Yeah, it's good. I mean, it's going to be hard to build anything in the middle. But as of right now, black has the advantage because of the two corners up top. I mean, the best I can do is try doing something to this one stone, but it's got plenty of places to go to. And I can't cap it, so I'd have to do a Kaima, but if I do a Kaima... I mean, yeah, I'm gonna get Sente for something. But the, the, the main concern is 
where. That's my concern. And I'm a worry wart. I'm always gonna worry. Because <laughs> I'm weird. <laughs> so. Okay, I'm sorry. That's just funny. I can. Okay, doesn't this... Can't I still kill this corner? Can't I still kill this corner? Because I know this is a bad move. Black should have done T4. I'm going to go for it. Yeah, it's going to be Ko. Yeah, it's most definitely going to be Ko. I'm not reading any other way to go about it. Wait, no, I can't do this. If I connect, black plays S3, and black is fine. So it's still Ko. But I can't connect. So it's still Ko. Oh, gosh darn it. Wasn't looking at the time. So, with this, now oh, it does alter it, gosh darn it.
So yeah, this this would have to be Ko because I I can't play this. So I'd have to play this and go about with the Ko. But I don't know. This is, I, I just don't know how to evaluate this game. I mean, the more I think about it, the more I just want to do that. But that's just, I just feel like that's too slow. But when this happens, yeah, I just block this way. Feels nicer. But at the same time, I mean, I don't know, I, it just depends, but... T6 was better, it seems, for setting up the code. What do you, what do you mean with that? Because, I mean, if I just play this, they're just going to do this. Or this. Even though it's going to be the same result, and it could end in Seki. Maybe. Perhaps. So... Yeah. I would have rather gone for the go rather than play T6. Oh, then cutting at S4. I think so. It's not really a co at this point if um, I play T6 instead. Because it's just going to end with me and Gote and Black still lives. So overall, I'll need to play this co if I want to capture the corner. But I guess if anything, I probably could have... No, no, it's okay. You don't need to apologize. You don't need to apologize. And this is the problem that I'm looking at. Something along these lines. This attachment. So I can't necessarily just cap, but if I do something like this, then we're just going straight down to black's thickness. Yeah, I'm getting outside strength, but where's my territory? I mean, I, I just, it's just, this is just one, this is one of those games where it's just, I, I literally do not know how to evaluate the game. And it's all because of things like this. No. No. Um, I'll show you. I'll show you. He might not be happy with me, though.
No, come here, come here. I'm going to shock you. Come here. Come here. really doesn't like being Little guinea pig. Yeah, totally a velociraptor, yeah, yeah. Nope, just a guinea pig. Brown spot on the face. This this is why I have the gloves. It's because he's a biter. Hey. Although he's biting less than he was before, which is really interesting. But yeah, he's crazy Mitch. I don't know if you can see it, but he's got a mohawk on his head. Yep, there's the ferocious biting. That's why I wear gloves. I keep moving him off screen. See, there's the biting again. Yep, there's the ferocious biting again. Stop it. <laughs> yeah, this is why I wear gloves. All right. I'll be nice to you. Come on, here we go. Yeah, he's probably gonna hate me more and more and more. Oh no, 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 he, he will still bite me if I have no gloves. But I'm glad you like him, Cosmic. <laughs> so, okay. But yeah, Velociraptor. I should have called him Crazy Velociraptor, because he... Yeah, he's a biter. Anyway, so... There we go. So, yeah, I, I don't really know what to think in about what to do here. I mean, now I'm thinking, hey, let's back off so we don't have to work, so we can keep territory. But... I don't know. I guess the next time we come across something like this, I'm going to have to uh, back off instead of doing a pincer. Why is my nose running so much? Okay, give me one quick second. Okay. But yeah, again, the noise was him uh, getting his water. Oh, I wish I need a refill. So, <laughs> totally, totally. Anyway, yeah. So yeah, next time I'll just have to try going about this way. But I might as well evaluate the rest of the game, I guess. I mean, that probably just means I need to play a high pincer normally black would want to play c6 so backing off is fine okay so yeah back up my goal would be to get sente to approach the, 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 the 
three four point. Yeah, normally wanting to play that. Okay, but uh, so explain your so like I mentioned before when I was talking about this. Explain yourself. Why would they want to go for this? Why? Why is the question of the day? And I've learned my lesson. I will not go this way again. Because I always, always get cut. Always. Always. So, this way. And then maybe that this way if black doesn't do anything over there. Uh, okay, but yeah, yeah, to approach the three point four point up there. Yeah, for the practice. I mean, ever 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 since um, Mister. Uh, brought up just play it until you feel confident I, I wanted to feel confident I wanted to try finding something to evaluate and sure enough I mean the close pincer led to the yeah um, I mean the close pincer I mean it it showed that um, even though black made the mistake of getting rid of the corner potential uh, Black got all this influence, and I didn't really have anything to use. Well, to just yeah, and um, I believe that is the correct answer actually for black because it with this I have that later on. But um, I mean at this point, I mean you. So you guys are saying that well with what. Um, with what was brought up before, you guys would say that you would just go through the three four right now. Um, Why did I play J three right away? Um, I just don't want him to go into the corner. I wanted to keep the corner. I mean, if I play away, now look at my two stones. I mean, if I do something like this, it is it's just it just doesn't look all that good. The, this side looks okay, but it's still got some weakness. It's got a six space jump. Um, actually, five. Two, three, four. Yeah, five. No, well, technically, four. Four, whatever. Because that's a one space jump. One, two, three. I'm weird. Don't judge me. So, yeah. Definitely do not let the corner go. Way different. Uh, what? When I played J3? To run out to H3. What? What? Unless you were. Oh, not. Well, okay, so not, not C3. When I played J3, oh, the reason why is because in the past I was told never to ignore this. To never ignore and go ahead and continue playing it out. It's just what I was always told and taught. But again, it's one of those things where no one told me why. Or if they did tell me why, it was very quick, it wasn't very deep in depth. So, yeah. Yeah. Was the correct sequence? Ignoring it? Or what I did? Because, I mean, it, yeah, yeah. So, yeah. Which is leading me to believe that if I want to do any, oh, okay. So, 
which leads me to believe that I shouldn't play low. If I if I really, it's funny. I always tell myself I don't want to go against influence, and I anytime I see a four four and a three four, the Chinese stuff, I always think they want to go for territory, and that they go for something like this. So I just need to prevent them from getting the influence. I should have just yeah. Anyway, next time high pincer or just back off. That's what I need to do next time. Especially if I really do not want that. But so here, here's the here's the thing. Then I mean, black protects. Now black has a wall, and I've got okay groups, I guess. But yeah, and I get sente. And a few of you guys were talking about going for the approach, even though I was thinking about the 4-4. Um, I, I just don't... I don't know. I, I don't know how to evaluate this. I've got no territory, except maybe a few points in the on the left and maybe something on the bottom. Here, black can easily pincer me. Excuse me, in some sort. Yeah, that, that's true. That, that that's true. But usually, yeah, pincer anxiety again. Yep. <laughs> Um, the reason why I'm worrying right now is because usually in this, in this position of a board, usually it turns out that I get nothing. Usually, it doesn't matter what I do in, in this situation of the board, if it continued on in other games in the past, it would continue on, I would get no territory, and my opponent would have this influence. It, it just happens every time. Which is why I was worrying. Yeah, personally, I feel behind here. Because who knows what's going to happen with uh, my approach here. Even though, I mean, most of me wants to say this, but now I've got the talk from the wire and stuck on my head. Which side is bigger? The top. So, he, I, don't, I don't mean to offend him. He, he doesn't talk like that. That's just me talking because I'm weird. Um, yeah, there's, yeah, there's plenty, plenty of things that can happen with that. But yeah, I mean, I definitely feel behind, especially with some kind of pincer, because... I mean, if we do something like this... Who knows this variation? Because this doesn't work. Anyway, I think. But, um, yeah. You feel a head is white? And do remember that it's been a, at least a month since I've last played. Or if I did play, it wasn't very serious. He wants to close off the top right. <laughs> Let's see. I mean, that's true. He played D2 and he played D, I mean, F. G5, which were definitely slow, yeah. Okay, then it probably is just me. <laughs> but, I, so I, I guess what I just need to do is just, I'm trying to, I guess this is just my block. I just don't see it. I'm worrying. But I guess, I just need to keep the simple things on mind, I guess, then. Just... The top is the bigger side. 
I do have d6, which is a high stone, to counter the wall that black is making. It's not making any territory right now, so I should be okay. And it's still the opening game. Anything can happen. I can still approach r14 at some time. I can, I don't know, I can surround the c16 stone, or I can live in the corner, or I can play k16 at some point, or just in general living on the top of something. It's true that anything can happen. I just, I guess I'm just... I just, I, I guess what was mentioned before, I just probably don't, just don't have that confidence. So, yeah, definitely something I need to work on. So I, I apologize for continuing blabbing. No, no, I don't apologize because I am weird. I am weird. I am weird. So, but I, I probably should speed things up a little bit and stop talking too much. So, 